Hey guys, welcome back to Hype RC. In today's video, we're going to be doing the stage two upgrades to our Fury Tech FX118 Fury Wagon. So this rig is absolutely amazing box stock, but Fury Tech came out with three brand new upgrades for this rig. So I went ahead and ordered them from Fury Tech USA, had them at the doorstep in just a couple of days. Let's head over to the bench and see exactly what we got. All right, guys, let's go ahead and take an up-close look at the Stage 2 upgrades for our FX118. We're going to start off with the stainless steel front steering links. That ought to stiffen up that front link quite a bit. Next, we're going to go ahead and install the stainless steel high clearance links with the aluminum skid plate. That ought to give us a ton more clearance on the bottom of this rig. And then the one that I'm the most excited about, this is the Torpedo 118 brushless combo. So it comes with the new Python Pro 40 amp ESC. This has 5 to 8.4 adjustable BEC. It is 4S capable. It has the FuryTech FOC and Bluetooth wireless module. It also comes with the new Cedar 1825 motor. This is a 3456 kV brushless in runner. It is 2 to 3S capable. It is 12 poles. It has a 6061 T6 aluminum body and is element resistant. So this ought to be a huge upgrade for this rig. So let's go ahead and get all these installed and we'll take a look at that. I'm also going to go ahead and slap on the 65 millimeter Enjora comp pin tires for this and then we're going to take this thing out for a nice crawl stick around and check it out all right, guys, I went ahead and got all those upgrades installed. So we've got our front steering links, our high clearance links and skid plate, and then the Torpedo 118 system with that Python Pro. Everything fit in very nice, very easy to install. So let's go ahead and get this thing out and hit the rocks.
right, guys, I had an absolute blast getting out and test running these three new upgrades on our FuryTech FX118. This thing runs amazing box stock, but I thought with these three upgrades, it would help improve performance, and it did. So let's go over each one of these upgrades in detail and talk about the pros and the cons of each one. We're going to start off with the Python Pro ESC. This little powerhouse is absolutely amazing. It is 2 to 4 S capable. You can turn the BEC up to 8.4. It's got a very nice aluminum case that helps dissipate all the heat and the Fury Tech Fury Car app, you can dial this thing in just right. Actually, no cons for this. This thing is all pro. That brings us to the Cedar motor. So this little in-runner motor, it's a 3456 kV motor, had this thing modulating very slow, tons of power. I love the fact that it's an in-runner and helps us be more weather resistant than those outrunners. That brings us to the front stainless steel steering link. This thing works very well on this rig. No more loose spaghetti noodle on the front. So when you need to wiggle out of a spot when you're crawling, no, you don't have any more slop in that front end. So that again is all pro and no con. That brings us to the stainless steel high clearance link. So there are pros and cons for this upgrade. The pro is, is that it gives you more clearance closer to the axles. The con is, is the rear part of the steering link that connects to the skid plate actually sticks out a little bit and has a tendency to kind of catch up on things. So it's kind of a give to get, but on my rock course, being able to have that extra clearance closer to the axles helped in improve the performance of this rig. So all in all, all of these together get a 9 out of 10 for me. I think they're absolutely amazing. I ordered them from Fury Tech USA and had them to my doorstep in just a few days. I didn't have to order them from across seas and wait for a week to 10 days for them to get here. So absolutely thrilled with these upgrades. I highly recommend all three of them. So don't forget to support your local hobby shops. Bash, crawl, repeat. Hit that subscribe and like button for me and ring the bell so you can catch my next video. We'll see you next time.